Hi guys, sadly the issue of asylum has really brought out the worst in people, and right-wing media seems determined to give these people not just a voice, but an unchallenged one. In similar fashion to the way the Express newspaper turns comments on an article into a new article, GB News invited on a lady called Jo to give her expert take on the issue of asylum and refugees. <sighs> it didn't go very well. Honestly, when they arrive, you wouldn't know from what country they came, come from because, bless them, they all look the same. If <sighs> She added, <laughs> bless them. Bless him. Okay. They all look the same. Uh, look, and there's no pushback here from the journalists at all. Um, you know, something like, that's pretty racist, isn't it? They all look the same. Uh, are people's... <laughs> is that how you determine whether somebody's a legitimate asylum seeker or not? Because of how they look? Really? If they don't speak English, you need somebody to translate for them and help them with paperwork. Okay, so then what's the alternative? If people don't speak the language, doesn't it make sense to help them complete the paperwork that's necessary so that they can complete the paperwork faster? What's the alternative for them not to complete the paperwork? For them to just wander around without the correct paperwork? What do you talk... Is this some sort of argument against where well, we shouldn't spend money on helping them complete the paperwork? They should do it themselves and not do it right? That's going to create other problems. Do these people actually think before they call into these shows? Etc. But a lot of them are sadly slipping through the system. Where are they going and what are they planning to do with our country? That's what... What do you mean? What are they planning to do with our country? Who are you talking about? Asylum seekers or billionaires? And once again, the, the quote-unquote journalists just sitting there and no response from them, no pushback, no, wait a minute, Joe, what the hell are you talking about? Wait a minute, Joe, what you're saying is pretty racist. But of course GB News won't push back on this because they agree with her. The narrative has been set. These people are bad. We have to dehumanize them. They're all the same. There's, there's a wave coming in. It's an invasion. They're not individuals. They're not people seeking help. They're not people who are trying to get to the UK because they have friends, family, connections to the UK. They speak the language. They don't want to stay in France. They don't want to claim asylum in France because they're far away from their family. From their connections. But the worst part of all of this is that you have the racists going unchallenged. The media's job is to challenge them, is to call it out, is to correct the record. But they don't. And that's a big problem. Let me know in the comment section guys what you think about all of this. As always your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.